Yo, too. What's happening, man? It's your boy King Said Gaming back with another video, man. Finally, starting to play through Shin Megami Tensei Nocturne Remastered for the PS4. I've been waiting on this game for a while, man. God damn, I cannot wait to uh, finally make it through the story because I did not complete the story when I was a kid playing it. We're gonna start a new game, Maniacs, because this had this has Dante from Devil May Cry in the story. Apparently, he was in the original game. I never made it that far in it. But without further ado, man, let's get this shit started. Oh, definitely gonna do normal. I don't remember ever seeing Merciful last time. Let's do normal. We want some type of challenge without dying a lot. We don't want it to be too easy. A world that loses its power will fade into nothing. If such is the fate of this world, then I shall return it to its mother's womb. The world must first die for it to be born again. This is the path to salvation, true. as foretold in an ancient prophecy. The world will fall for its... But I won't let you meet the same fate. I want to help you hold on to your life. To do so, I need to know your name. Will you tell me who you are? Sure thing. You tell me who you are. She talking like she just run out of damn thing. I really don't understand, but okay. I'm supposed to say I will. The time is near. Everything that is will be rewritten. I am the nurturer of the next world. The template for our future rests within my hands. Now, I want you to say my name aloud. She sound freaky as hell, but okay. Okay, we're just gonna stick with the base name, Takao Yuko. That's right. <sighs> no, I won't shed another tear, not even at this world's end. Instead, I can invite you to the world that is to come. Now go ahead, wake up. The time is here. To Yoyogi Park ASAP. Time's a wasting. And they want me to name every character in the game. I'm just going to go with base names. Alright, so before we start this, I'm gonna be forewarned. I'm gonna forewarn you guys. This is a remake or a remaster of a PS2 game, so the graphics are not that pretty. I guess I'll start reading off the text since there's no uh no voiceover. Alright, station staff, let me guess you're here for your yogi park. 
Ever since the incident went down, it's been one look, looky loop after another. No one's here for the train. As you can probably tell, I've had a lot of time on my hands. You've heard the news, right? No, I haven't. Guess I'll inform you there was a deadly ride at your Yogi Park yesterday. If you want the gory details, go check the giant screen at Shibuya. Long story short, a couple folks lost their lives in that park. You hear the sirens wailing all night long. In a way, they didn't mean to talk your ear off. It's just nice to have some conversation once in a while. Oh, you lonely. Uh, let me see. We pretty much explored everything around here. Should be nothing this way that I can go to. Here's another thing on this playthrough. They're gonna be long playthroughs, and we're exploring every nook and cranny of every area. Got to do that with RPGs. Leave no stone unturned. Due to investigation and interest in your the park has been closed off. We appreciate your cooperation. While I do feel the demonstrators' actions were out of line, the fact that Cyber's communication would destroy the park for their own gain is not only inconceivable, it's unforgivable. The reporters and passions feature to me. Okay. Just gonna caught one moment with suffering mentalities that makes everybody dressed like it's a goddamn carnival. Take that long haired yuppie wandering around, for instance. You hear about the ride where three people died, what if we're next? You don't gotta worry about that, babe. Why? Because we're about to start our own little ride in the bedroom. Okay. Alright. And that clapping them cheeks. Alright, boy. Wow, could you be any more predictable? I guess that's what I love about you. <laughs> My man's about to be in there clapping them cheeks. So don't okay, I'm not gonna read everything. broke out yesterday at Yogi Park regarding the construction of the communication tower. The demonstration got out of hand and there have been several deaths and injuries reported. Furthermore, Hikawa, the top executive for Cyprus Communication, remains missing. I feel lazy. Yeah. Alright. Damn. I ain't no damn creek. What kind of shit is that? Figure out where I gotta go. This foreign guy dressed in red passed by not long ago. Of all things, he had a giant sword on his back, a sword, and boy, he looked dangerous. Now, I know I've seen him somewhere before, but where? Let's be talking about Dante. I think I need to go to this hospital. Yep. There's a note on the door. The entrance to the annex is closed. Please use the entrance to the main building hospital staff. No one's here. I seem to remember going to the hospital last time. Thursday ass people on the street, man. There we go. Okay, 
that is back to the station. Damn it. So the little buildings with red on them is where I can enter them. But I can't go over to the park. Okay, yes I can. I had to go this way. That shit, it's, it's gonna take some getting used to with that map. Great. It's kinda weird. The entire park's closed off. They can't even let a guy in to snap a few photos? <sighs> Guess it's not my lucky day. Huh? You need something, kid? Well, here's what they said on TV. Panic erupts as a clash between corporate representatives and a civic organization ends in violent deaths. Oh, bro. Pretty disturbing, right? But those who live on the fringe say it was a deeper struggle between two cults. Uh, I think that's your phone going off. Hey, are you there? Finally, I get a hold of you. What's taking you so long? Tachibana Chiaki. I could see if it was our other friend, but you're never late. You wake up on the wrong side of the bed? Where are you now? Yoyogi Park? Well, since you decided not to show, we had to leave without you. We're almost there now. So, yeah, would you mind coming straight to the hospital? You do know which hospital it is, right? Shinjuku Medical Center. Hey, man, why should you try to play me like I'm slow or something, man? Calm down. Just go east from Shinjuku Station and keep going. You can't miss it. Hmm, I guess this works out. I was planning to ask our teacher for career advice, so I'll just go ahead of you. Thanks. Keep there, in mind, I don't plan on staying too long, okay? See you later. Hold up. You're on your way to Shinjuku Medical Center? Hmm. That's also where I'm headed, oddly enough. Go figure. Why don't you hang on to this? It's a copy of our upcoming issue. I'm assuming you don't know what went down here. Then, you probably don't know what kind of place that hospital is either. What? The name's Hijiri. Author of The Ring of Guy and the Scripture of Moroku. Might want to give that a read. That shit sound demonic. Scripture of Moroku. Normally, you wouldn't associate a hospital with the occult. That hospital is anything but normal. Or so they say. There's a lot of misinformation floating around these days. If it turns out I'm wrong, just laugh it off, okay? Anyway, I'd better be going. Oh yeah, in the event we run into each other again, let me know how you liked my article. Your thing, boss. Alright, now I remember where the hospital is at. So I think I do. We at the top to the right. God damn it. Look to the other door. Well, hey, about time. Um, is it just me, or is something seriously off here? I mean, yeah. Shit quiet as fuck. Hmm. There isn't anyone in sight. No nurses, no patients. Look, even the reception desk is empty. Don't you think there's something weird about this place? I sure do. Anyway, you know who is looking for our teacher right now. And big surprise, he's still gone. He'd better not be off goofing around. Oh, what's with that magazine? Some stranger gave it to you? Come on, you should know better than that. Bro, I get a magazine monthly. from somebody. Never heard of it before. I'm wrong with that. What? It's an occult magazine? 
Why would you bring something like that here? <sighs> well, maybe it could help me kill some time. Anyway, can you go find that bonehead? If he can't find our teacher, then I don't want to be... You should be on the second floor, where the patients' rooms are. I'll be waiting down here. Oh, and leave the mag with me. Don't leave me hanging too long, okay? Elevator around here or nothing? Some more steps. Someone's in the other hallway. I fuck it look like he up to something. I know one thing, the camera the camera angle is gonna take some getting used to. It kinda sways too much. It's a little weird. Nothing this way. scared the crap out of me. Now, why'd you go sneaking up like that? Jeez, you come here late, you cause trouble. You know what? Forget it. Not worth it. I'm sure you've already noticed, but this place has been cleaned out. You think everyone, uh, died off? That's what it seemed like. I called our teacher to make sure this was it. She clearly told me. Shinjuku Medical Center. Something's definitely up. I could have at least put up a notice or something so visitors aren't clueless. Maybe someone unleashed a deadly virus in here. I've already checked out everywhere that. she might be. I'm running out of places to look. Think we should just call it? All right. I'm gonna head back down and check out how our other lady's doing. I bet she's all pissed because I've been gone so long. <sighs> It ain't easy pleasing a princess. Anyway, I really hope this isn't the shitstorm it's shaping up to be. Find my way back downstairs. You're back. So, you know that special report at the beginning of the magazine? Well, it says some things that are more than a little. According to this, there's a group of demon worshippers who call themselves the Ring of Gaia. And they're right here in Japan. Apparently, they believe in this book of prophecy called the Scripture of Miroku. In that book, it says that chaos will engulf the world, and these people are trying to cause that somehow. Whether their idea of chaos means terrorism or something else entirely, the reporter couldn't figure that out. But get this. Uh, no luck finding her. I even checked the men's room. Ugh, didn't need to know that. We're in the middle of a conversation here, so save those details for later. 
Now, listen to this part. A hospital on the east side of Shinjuku is closely linked to the organization's sinister plan. What the fuck? Let me guess. That ends with... Find out more in our next issue. Sounds about right. Oh, it wouldn't surprise me if that article had some truth to it. I've heard some real spooky shit about this place. Like how they run deadly experiments on patients. Or how a psychic started shrieking and bolted out of here. And of course, there's a rumor that a cult's behind it all. You're serious? I never knew any of that. Maybe we really shouldn't have come here. I almost feel stupid for buying into some bizarre tabloid. But it does get one thing right. How creepy... Mm-hmm. We really need to find her, don't we? Okay. We search this place top to bottom one last time. If nothing pops up, we assume nothing's wrong, and we split. By the way, looks like you can reach the annex from the second floor. I'll go take a look up there. Whereas you have the honor of searching the basement. Oh, and, uh, you'll need this. Yeah, you're just gonna throw me in You're the, the one basement. who found the card. Why don't you search the basement? Yeah, why don't you get your ass down there in the basement? Could it be you're too scared? Come on, this is me we're talking about. The only reason he's going is because I'm sure there's nothing down there. That made no sense. Look, all you need to do is confirm that our teacher isn't in the basement. Got it? After all, saving the day is my job. Should things take a turn for the worse, just run like hell, okay? I can't believe him sometimes. Anyway, let's focus on finding our teacher. No matter what, we have to make sure she's safe. Alright. How do I get to the basement? Oh, the elevator. Where everything gonna pop off it right here. disrupt this stillness only a lost lamb a well-known poet once said April is the cruelest month have you any inclination as to why I do not because it is then one awakens from a long sleep and faces the barren world our history as a species is similarly barren comprised of empty trivialities. The worthless overgrowth of a civilization blind to its sins, continuous war and bloodshed, and thousands of years of repeating the same mistakes over and over again. The world 
needs to wipe its slate clean. The way to salvation was foretold in the scripture of Miroku. And today, that prophecy shall be fulfilled. The old world will sink like a setting sun. And the new world will arise in its place. Now, how should I deal with you? From what I recall, you weren't among our followers who survived the purge at the park. Oh, you're her acquaintance. Come to think of it, this was a hospital, wasn't it? And you merely came to visit her. However, even a pebble creates ripples when cast in water. And while I do feel pity for you, your life ends here. Oh wow. Got right to the chase, huh? Do not be afraid. All the inhabitants of this world will follow before long. Pretty sure that monster name is Popamit. Your time has just come a bit sooner. That's all. Should I face him or run away? You fool. No one can overcome their fate. I ain't no bitch. I ain't running. Stop! Huh? What? You can't even let one person go? What effect could he possibly have on our plan? However insignificant he is, I am not a man of exceptions. You know this. Fine. If you don't spare him, then consider our partnership over. <sighs> Such a troublesome maiden. Well, I'll leave the teaching to the teacher. Please leave this room. I would like to enjoy this blissful end in solitude. I'll be waiting on the roof. We'll have a good view of the city from there. Come, see it with your own eyes. Witness that which will change the world. Can you imagine some shit like this happening? Like, imagine somebody just like... Okay, I actually got an auto... I didn't know that. Imagine some shit like this actually happening, and somebody recruits you to save the world. Or end it. That, that, that shit, I don't know, that's just crazy, man. I don't know what I would do, honestly. Someone is up ahead. What the hell is this creepy-ass little boy? What's wrong, my little master? Are you curious about that person over there? Oh, is that so? My, my. But right now, we have other matters to attend to. Let's do that afterward. to the roof. So, here we are again. I'm glad I intervened when I did. I wouldn't want you to fall prey to a demon. You heard what Hikawa said, right? This world is about to be swallowed by chaos. It's called the Conception, the rebirth of the world, an event which no human has ever witnessed. Everyone outside of this hospital will perish. I doubt anyone would approve of such a terrible thing. But even if we did keep this old world alive, it would eventually lose all its power. It's so crazy, like... 
I don't know. I, I'm trying not to get like really religious, but I feel like this game is definitely going to be religious. But even in the world that we live in, it's the same thing. Like the world has to end for it to be reborn anew. Like we know something like this will happen one day. You know what I mean? Like it's just crazy to think about that. The world must first die for it to be born again. Especially with the world we live in nowadays, like it's just so chaotic, just so much bullshit going on at all times. Anyways, man, I'm not gonna get into that, man. Let's get back to the game. And I alone will carry the burden of its sin. As for regrets, I have none. What matters is that fate reached out and led you here. And it is your fate to live through the conception. It may actually be more painful than death. But I believe in you. Please. Come find me when it's done. No matter how the world changes, I'll be your pillar of strength. It is my duty as the Maiden to take part in shaping the new world. Meaning I can show you a better way to live. I know it must be difficult for you to understand. But we're out of time. Listen. If you can find me on your own, I promise to tell you everything. The answers to all your questions, and what my intentions really are. Hmm. Make sure I come find your ears, then. this motherfucker deep ass voice you have nothing stirring within you not even a hint of reason for the one who will shape the world this cannot be go forth and discover yourself what will be the legacy of your existence Do not be afraid. My little master has taken an interest in you. Pitiful human though you are, he wishes to grant you a gift. It is vital that you receive it, and I'm afraid you have no choice. Please try not to struggle. It will only hurt for an instant. They're the ones that made me half demon and half human. What the fuck? 
Damn, Parasite? Magatama is the essence of demonic power. Magatama. With it, you have joined the ranks of demons. My little master is always watching, so please try not to bore him. You obtained the Magatama Marokare. The main menu you can view and interest Magatama. For am I that pure? You're the demon here. Hmm. That door still locked. You can hear something from inside the room. Who's there? Wait, aren't you that kid I met at the park? What in God's name happened to you? I sure myself. I see. Well, at least you still think like a human. That aside, you know what the hell's going on here? Last thing I remember, I was blinded by a bright light. After that, I was in this room. From the look of it, we're in some sort of hospital. Seeing as you're here too, I take it this is Shinjuku Medical Center? Well, first things first. So now I have a question. So if he was on the outside of the hospital, how did he not get swallowed by the light? How the hell did he wind up in the hospital? That means he has a, a bigger effect on his store than I thought. As much as I want to know what's going on out there, it's not exactly safe to walk around. Have you come across any of them yet? Any of what? Well, they're definitely not human. My guess is that they're demons. My strange experience, your new look, and these weird creatures. Something tells me calling the cops won't do us any good. Nope. But damn, if my hunch is right, there's an actual explanation for all this. Though I'd rather not believe it. This is Shinjuku Medical Center. I can't just rule it out. The conception may have occurred for real. You know, I've seen a barrel like this before. If I remember right, it belonged to a man named Yukawa. He's gotta be behind this somehow. Just standing here talking won't do us any good. Listen. If you're strong enough to fight, could you gather some information while you're at it? I tried talking to what looked like a ghost, but I didn't have much luck. What's happened to the world? And, is there anyone else out there? We can only find the answers by finding other people. I wish I could do it myself, but I doubt I'd last long. Besides, I imagine studying this thing has its own merits. So for now, I leave it to you. Save real quick.
the Amala drum. So these are saved once. The Lord still the first things first. Try and make it outside. Alive. What would a demon like you want with me? I hear your wounds, so please don't decide to eat them. I hear your wounds anytime, so don't eat me, please. So he was a doctor at this hospital. Who are you? Yet another demon after Magat Magat Sush Magat Suhi Magat Suhi. Hell is a Magat Suhi. Strange place. Come, show me the strength of a demon. Is that that little boy and that old woman? Why is he old? There's a lot of damn questions for him. Uh, Cache AQ uh, as well. There's the times too. Alright, first battle. Let's get it. Willow Whips. Stats. Let's get a little bit more strength. Maroka Red has begun to act finally within you. Let it continue. Warm light from Maroka Red engulfs the area before you recover. Hmm. Shady surgeon. By my master's orders, I'll treat your wounds. different Megatama. Okay, that's money. It's been so long since I played this shit, man. I forgot a lot of stuff. This way. Rock. What the hell is that? 
low fire damage to our foes. Medicine. Make it easy for you, boy. I'm going to try to go with a balance build. If that'll be best. So, you made it. Your strength is outstanding we shall meet again soon i'm looking forward to it He said something about the annex. I think you can access it from the second floor. Uh, it's still the same, I said. Thought they destroyed the world. It's still the same, I said. around on this floor try to get as many items as possible. And escape this. Where the hell I get that at? seen a demon quite like you hey are you looking for something yeah about that thing hey about that thing you're looking for i'll help you if you want in fact i'll even be your demon ally want to know what i'm looking for a demon who can take me to your yogi park you look kind of flabby and weak but i'll let that slide <laughs> damn okay <laughs> throwing them shots have the past thinking we can get through that door to the annex. I saw some princess carrying it. Nice to meet you. I'm Pixie the Fairy. Pixie the Fairy, I'm sure would be the best of friends. I'll take you. really good she can heal us that works out now I got a healer on the group wow. got 
Laughing at her ass when she said that. Let me start recruiting demons now. Now that she said that. Stronger than you up ahead in the annex. You'll probably get shredded in an instant. Nice knowing you. Damn, appreciate the vote of confidence, you jackass. Demon swimming around the lobby like he owns the place. That's Fornius. As long as he's around, you might as well kiss any hopes of leaving this hospital alive. Goodbye. Well, we're just gonna go down there and whoop his ass then. Man, he got a crown on his head. Or am I tripping? He has a fucking crown on his head, okay? So he a cocky little motherfucker. I can see it. I can see you suffering in your battle against the demons. This future is only one of many possibilities. The future is not written in stone. I shall help you. What future do you desire? I'm gonna say a dark future. But if you wish for a dark future, continue to use useless attacks. Let your attacks be notified, reflected, or drained. You do all of this in dark future full of defending. Shall await you. Okay, a bright future. You wish for a bright future, know your enemies and use attacks they are weak against. If you do, a bright future full of attacking shall await for you. It is not easy to learn your enemies' weaknesses. Only through battle shall you gain knowledge. Okay. What 
the hell? Magic vitality, agility, and love. Let's get another point of vitality. Okay, that's a good skill to have. It's analyze. And I can see uh, demon's weaknesses. Pretty much every demon is allergic to damn lightning, anyways. So, neighbor so much got to worry about dead psychics so boss. I have never seen a demon like you. Take this as a sign of our meeting. Same as us demons have a roof. I was kind of hoping to get like another demon on the board. Trying to eat me, is he? Hey, wait a sec, you're a demon too. Oh, okay. Revival bead. Probably need to use that. trying to defeat Fornius, are you? I am. Tough as you may be, you'll never beat him alone. Don't just jump punch every demon you see. If you talk to them right, you can convince them to join you. Excuse me, but did you know Fornius is a big, strong meanie? Oh, and the adults said demons were outside, too. Hey, might have scared this phoniest motherfucker except me. I ain't scared this motherfucker. Seduce. Okay. Here it's up, you know. It's not giving me an option to talk to the demons to uh, recruit them yet. Time to spare us a uh, human sneak past Fornius just a while ago. Here 
are some races of demons that rarely draw on through negotiation methods. There's a trick to negotiate with demons. Demons stick together, so defeat the demons in the way first. They disrupt conversations. stop it right there kind of running over recording time we've been at this for an hour now uh, hopefully you guys enjoyed part one man if you did make sure you smash the like button also sub if you're new i catch you in part two we'll be releasing right after this one till next time it's me your boy king said game in the map peace i, I thought you knew